here to illustrate our article titled A Comparison of Conventional versus Automated Digital Pass Scoring Using the CareStream 3600 Scanner and CS Model Plus Software System. This randomized clinical study was carried out by myself, Sana Lukmani, and Alan Jones at Kingston Hospital, Manoharan Andiapan, and Martin Coburn at King's, King's College London. PAR, or Peer Assessment Rating, is an occlusal index that was developed to quantify objectively malocclusions in five categories, namely contact point displacements in the anterior segments, buccal occlusion in all three planes, the overjet, overbite, and dental center lines. Conventionally, PAR scoring is performed by a trained and calibrated individual using a specific acetate ruler. The greater the deviation, the higher the score. Manual PAR scoring can be time consuming and despite calibration, some aspects of the assessment have been shown to have low reliability. The use of cast dental study models is also on the decline as they can pose a considerable storage problem for many orthodontic practices in hospitals. Digital models are now an accepted alternative they are a three-dimensional virtual representation of a patient's malocclusion that can be viewed and manipulated on a computer screen quite similar to traditional cast models. Digital models can be produced either by indirect digitization, that is by scanning existing plaster casts, or through direct digitization, which is intraorally scanning a patient's occlusion directly. The CS Model Plus software system was developed by CareStream Dental. It automatically detects landmarks and allows automated pass scoring. There is no need for separate measurements of the contact point displacements, the overjet, overbite, etc. The software is marketed together with CareStream's intraoral scanners. We decided to investigate the validity of digital pass scoring using this software system by comparing conventional manual assessment with automated scoring of digital models using direct digital models, that is intraoral scans of patients and indirect digital study models, that is scans of existing plaster casts. The primary outcome was mean calculated PAR score. The null hypothesis was that there was no difference in PAR scores between the three different scoring methods. Secondary outcomes included mean chair side time and the time taken to calculate PAR scores, as well as patients' perception of the clinical procedure. The subjects received conventional dental impressions and intraoral scanning at the same appointment in a randomized order. PAR scores were then calculated for each of the participants using all three different methods and then the scores were repeated after 14 days. All clinical procedures and scorings were in addition timed with a stopwatch. For our analysis, the significance of all tests was set at 0.05. The final sample consisted of 67 patients with a mean age of 15 years. We found that there was no significant difference in mean PAR scores between the three different study groups. There was also no significant difference between the first and second scoring for any of the three groups. Amongst the secondary outcomes, mean chair side time for intraoral scanning was significantly higher at almost 8 minutes compared to 5.35 minutes for conventional impression taking. The differences in scoring times were also significant. 91% of patients preferred intraoral scanning. There were no associations between procedure preference and patient age, gender, or the order in which the clinical procedure was performed, or even the procedure that was performed, perceived as being quicker. To summarize, 
The aim of this study was to investigate the validity of automated digital pulse scoring using the CareStream 3600 intraoral scanner and CS Model Plus software system. We found no significant difference between mean pulse scores calculated manually from plastercast and automated, automated pulse scores from scanned plastercast and chairside intraoral scans. Interestingly, manual pass scoring took significantly less time than the automated methods. Conventional impression taking also took significantly less time than intraoral scanning. However, the majority of patients expressed a preference for intraoral scanning. We concluded that automated PAR scoring with CS Model Plus software system was a valid method for PAR scoring. The intraoral scanner and software used in this study were supplied to us by CareStream Dental. We would like to especially thank David Claridge for his help and support. We also thank our co-researchers and the editorial board of the AJODO for allowing us to share our research with you.